What took you so long? That's funny. I was about to ask you the same question. Were you? You looked pretty surprised to see me. What's surprising is how annoying you are. If you've come to give me a lecture, save it. I've had enough of them today. I didn't come to talk. I came to fight. You're even less material than I am, which I guess makes you lucky. You both know that I'd crush you. All those delicate little feelings you have. Maybe in the past, but after all of those conversations, which seem to have weakened you enough to let me pay a visit. Vincent dropped the spell, which means we're back in our mind and also explains why the French Quarter is so empty. It means that I can finally kick your ass. <laughs> I hope we're not too late. Aurora! Aurora! Dude! Please let that be oil. He hurt her. Took her. That's not the only thing he took. Are you scared yet? Or was I just right about you being weak? Your weakness is the only reason I exist. If you and your family think your feelings are so freaking powerful, why'd you shut off your humanity? Why have you kept it off this entire time? Why have you sat back and watched all the horrible things that I've done because of it? Maybe once I figure that out, you'll be gone for good. But in the meantime, I'd like to point out that you feel plenty of powerful things too. Anger, resentment, rage. Humanity is just the strength to not give in to them. So make no mistake, you are the most emotional person that I've ever met. And I know Lizzie Saltzman. You're still a murderer too. I had nothing to do with killing Landon. That was all you. I am you. And you were the worst parts of me. Every mistake. Every doubt and every bad impulse. And let's talk about who you are. Is someone who's always gonna need me, who won't admit it, and will never be in control. Because like I said, I'm the strong one. <laughs> ah! If that were true, that probably would hurt. Only Red Oak can kill the tribe, Red, remember? And if you were in control of our mind right now, you'd have some instead of me. Why won't you just go away? Because I am my father's daughter, not you. And today reminded me of how much he and my family love and have sacrificed for me. I have to be worth that, and I won't be. If I keep letting you set the world on fire instead of living up to what you were meant to be. You're just a phase. And in case you haven't noticed, I'm over it. Oh.